Welcome to our series about art and interior design. Hi, I'm Corina from Atelier Vico and today I'll present you the first painting from our latest collection and I'll show you in which interior design space would fit in. So this is the one and it's called Tangerine. First of all, let me tell you which are the two styles that I think that this painting would really fit in. And the two styles are Bauhaus and mid-century modern. Okay, so Bauhaus style started in 1990 and lasted till 1933. And I'll tell you a few characteristics about the style so you will understand why I think that this painting is gonna fit in in this style. And the characteristics are geometric shapes, functionality first, primary colors, and clean lines. Next, starting in mid to late 1950s, mid-century modern, the retro-futuristic design, it's a reflection of Bauhaus style and they kind of go really well together. And speaking of this style, I'll tell you a few characteristics about it as well. So it's all about the clean lines, the combination of natural and man-made materials, the vibrant colors, the graphic design, and the futuristic looks. And now I'll show you a few spaces that this 3D painting tangerine could fit in really well. So I'll start with this insertion, and here it's all about the minimalism. In this living room, the furniture is very simple, with sleek lines and clean lines, and it focuses on functionality and uncluttered space. So this 3D painting tangerine would really complete the space because the chromatic of the painting would go really well with the table and the lamp on the floor because they have similar tones of this orange. In the next one, it's all about mixing the materials. And we talk about man-made materials like plastic, vinyl, and fiberglass as a characteristic of the style. And this dining room would go perfectly with the tangerine 3D painting. Look at the simplicity of the furniture. The chairs are made from a simple piece of material held up by the metal thin legs. So mixing the materials from our 3D painting and the materials from the furniture would really go with the aesthetic of the room. And in case you are wondering where I place the painting, it would be right above the blue screen. Next, on our third picture, it's all about the natural hues and the pop of colors. So this room is designed with neutral colors, so a bright accent color against the tones of black, white and wood tones would definitely complete the space. As an example, to see the difference, I'll insert another painting from our latest collection to see how it would change the space and it would brighten up the wall. In keeping with the idea of combining the indoor with the outdoor, the color palette of mid-century modern is bright oranges and yellows and our color 3D painting would be a great choice for this space. And this final space is gonna be around build your room around statement pieces. So the idea is to choose one or two signature pieces to create your design around it. It can be a coffee table or a metal frame chair. And use the rest of your design elements from the color palette to artworks to window treatments to complement and to highlight the statement pieces. And here, the orange painting, the tangerine painting, would really match the steel chair and it would create a great ambience. So this is all for this episode. Let me know in the comments which space do you think is the best for our 3D painting. Thank you so much for watching and we would be really grateful if you'd like to subscribe to our channel. Also, let me know if you'd like to make another episode where I tell you about the viral new pieces from IKEA that would go really well with our 3D paintings.